Coming up next, it's a UFC heavyweight division collision. Stands distance as well as any striker in this division. Of course, that is a byproduct of a lifetime of repetitions in the kickboxing space. And now our tale of the tape for this heavyweight fight. So three years the gap in age between these two fighters, with some differences in height and a similar reach. Now for the official Ladies introductions, the veteran voice of the Octagon, is Bruce Buck. Event of the evening. When the action begins, our referee in charge of the Octagon, Dan Mergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold-out Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City, it's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 185 pounds, fighting out of New Delhi, India, Juggernaut. All right, give me the rules of the locker room. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. On a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, so back to your corners, come out fighting. You ready? You ready? better backdrops for a mixed martial arts live event than this Madison Square Garden, the world's most famous arena. And you remember when we finally got here in 2016, we've been showing up strong ever since. Because every time you go to MSG, you should come with a bigger base. This is a phenomenal arena. This is a fantastic fight environment. New York City, baby, the city of dreams. And he landed the right hand there. Rock him, shock him out of the shoot here. Marty closes the distance, gets the single collar tie. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the jump. All right, so a nice shot there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be. And if you do that, most times you will block the shot that's incoming. Lee's got the tie clinch. Let's see what he can do. Nice punch land. Nice one, two there. Again, back into this position. Elbow from the clinch lands. Oh, that is a nice straight punch by him there. He's got it all going tonight. No wasted actions, no loopy punches. He's going right to the target. Oh, nice elbow. Body kick is blocked. Just misses with the jab there. All right, he engages in a single collar tie here. Left hand punch from the clinch. He gets to his spot. The top. Oh, late defense on the takedown and scrambles to his feet. Nicely done. Back to the feet now. Big punch lands. Stuffs the takedown there. How good is his takedown defense? Two minutes have expired in our opening round. Whiffs on the straight right hand. Goes upstairs for an elbow. Single collar tie now. Nice. Now he's got the Muay Thai plug. I mean, he's cutting him down the side with these beautiful leg kicks. Oh, man, this guy kicks like a mule. So hard. He kicks so hard every time you can see him driving his head into his opponent. Oh, he's got that right hand going tonight, DC. Connected with it there. He's thrown so many left jabs 
to throw that right punch straight down the pipe. It's unreal. Oh, nice jab. And here he is back in familiar territory in the clinch. And they separate. Big body kick lane. And both guys really throwing with authority. Oh, big knee. Oh, big knee. He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Just missing on the counter there. As he gets close, he's out of the kicking range. He'll, suddenly, he'll change his stance. And they separate. Well, defense doesn't necessarily win championships in MMA, but he's doing a nice job blocking these shots. He's not allowing his opponent to get any damage off on him by blocking all these attacks. Got the single collar tie. Takedown defense holds up. Big punch lands over the top. I was going to follow this one. All right, single collar tie now. Now connects with the right. Timely defense there, huge block for him. Keep your hands up, use your footwork now. It's okay, use your footwork. Swing and a miss by Lee. Just a slip there. Look at the control of the posture as he land that knee. And now he's got that tie clinch. We'll see what he can do with it. Boy, tie club. Big ball punch land. Now he gets back to range. Oh, tags him with the straight. Nice job there by Lee. Over and over, he landed his big body kick. Oh, right left combo by Lee. Spinning back fist. Didn't see that one coming. Single collar tie there. And they separate. Round two straight ahead. All right, there's the end of the round. We'll show you some of the highlights. It must feel pretty damn good to knock a man down like that. It feels good to knock a man down. And most times, you don't even feel it. It's the ones that you don't even recognize that landed hard are the ones that usually put your opponent out. It landed right on the sweet spot, and he hurt his opponent very badly. You ready? You ready? Second round underway. Not there. Right hand punch from the clinch. So we'll see if he can turn this defense into offense, but he's doing a great job blocking shots here tonight. As of right now, he's thinking more defensively, and he's doing a great job of not taking any damage. Wind it up on the right there to no avail. All right, he engages in the single collar tie. Oh! Outstanding output on both sides. All right, well, he's landed some good shots tonight, but there's no three piece, there's no soda. More often than not, it's one and done. He's not even getting a combination. I mean, oh. if you're going to sit there at the drive thru, order a combination, take the soda with your food, give him the right hand behind the jab, give him the hook behind the right hand, jab, right hand, hook. That's two pieces of chicken and a biscuit. Finish him off with the uppercut. That is your soda. I mean, come on, man. Let this guy have the whole thing. Nice control in that collar tie. And a massive elbow land around the guard. Oh, and he connects there. Pretty nice punch there. Great job, finally. Oh! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad.
going to the body now with the kick. That one is blocked, though, by Lee. Good punch, land. And they separate. Well, he has really picked up the pace here in round two. Much more aggressive than we saw in round one. And now starting to find himself oh. in the fight. Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. An elbow! Oh, no! All right, dominant position here. He's got the full mount. A lot of different ways he can go here. Maybe try to find an arm bar or just get the ground and pound. He can't attack submission. But those submissions will present themselves once he is landed. Now the guy's got on bar. He's attacking it on it. He's gonna attack on bar here. Continuing to try to manipulate the head here. It's in there deep. There you go. He gets it done by submission tonight, champ. Just watch how slowly he approaches the submission, though. He never rushes. He takes his time, but it's his trickiness. It's his ability to trick people into going to the floor with him that puts them in danger and finishing fights. So there he is, your winner by submission, and that's exactly how you put the rest of this division on notice. Looks like this guy could be a factor moving forward in this division. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Bergliotta has called a stop to this contest at three minutes, 22 seconds of round number two. He's going to win our by tap out, Juggernaut! Well, what an incredible result here tonight as you see the winner there celebrating his victory by way of submission, and they put so much stock into finishing this fight. They felt like to really spin his career forward they needed to not just win, but get the finish, and they certainly got it tonight. They got the finish. He's such a terrific grappler. Every time he is on his back, he looks for submissions over and over again.